Last week, there was a movie that got a bunch of Oscar nominations. Can you guess which movie it was? Is there any member of a royal blood who wishes to challenge for the throne? This corset is really uncomfortable. So could we all just wrap it up and go home? Can you guess how many Oscar nominations they got? Not one, not two. Not two, not three, not four, not five, not six, not seven. Seven Oscar nominations. The Black Panther, you see I'm geared up. And we're going to talk about that in this video. In time, you will know what it's like to lose. To feel so desperately that you're right, but to fail all the same. Dread it. Run from it. Destiny still arrives. What's good, YouTube? You're in the building with y'all knowing and loving y'all, feeling them, seeing all powerful. It's damn all everything, the sex is hell host. What do we do on this channel? We review everything, tech, cord cutting, pop culture, um, snakes, hot, we review everything up here. And today we're reviewing, is it okay, is it good? Black Panther got nominated for seven Oscars and we're gonna talk about it, but first, plus seven glasses of the sex is hell, baby. Cause I'm working on skilling up my craft, bringing you a more informed YouTube experience, something better to look at. If you like these reviews, you want me to review something, go over, like the Facebook Life Games page, send me a message, I'll do it. So Black Panther is the first comic book movie in history to be nominated for Best Picture. They got nominated for Best Visual and a whole lot of other good stuff. One area I feel like they snubbed was Ryan Coogler. Because if you're going to nominate Best Picture, you might as well nominate the director. Having said all that, for the groundbreaking that this movie did, there were a lot of people that just hated on the movie because they don't like this whole thing about having women, uh, minorities. They, and a lot of people just really and true, let's just keep this thing real. A lot of people hate Michael B. Jordan. Michael B. Jordan ruined Fantastic Four for them. And a lot of people hate him, so they bring their hate over here to Black Panther. But ladies and gentlemen, you cannot deny this was a good movie. And no matter whether you are a Marvel fan, DC fan, any comic book fan, you have got to be happy that this movie has been brought into the mainstream of Oscars. It's been hard for movies like this, comic movies, to get into the Oscar world. I do feel like Logan should have been nominated for a lot. I mean, that was a hell of a movie too. Logan was a great movie, but it didn't. And this movie did. And this movie was more than just a comic book movie, ladies and gentlemen. This movie had real life dynamics that are even going on now. You had um, a group of people trying to isolate themselves from the rest of the world, not with a steel wall, but with a hologram wall that blocks everything. You had a, a person that was oppressed from that group who wanted revenge not just on that group because he felt like they could have helped with other people oppressing the world of his same yield. You had women leads that did a hell of a job. You had all these great, great profound dynamics. This was not fucking Medea. This was not just a shoot 'em up comic book movie. This was a grounded, deep comic book movie and I got frustrated when one of my favorite reviewers and critics on YouTube said he didn't like that this movie got nominated because he liked Avengers Infinity War better, which I did too. But you don't win Oscars on that. You win Oscars on the depth of the movie. And this was a very deep comic book movie. So I want to just say to everybody, if you're a comic fan, be happy, celebrate it. You see the pathway to getting your movie into the Oscar nomination. And I can't wait to see what happens with Black Panther 2. They're already talking about 
pushing the date back on Black Panther 2 because of the success of Aquaman. They're trying to bring in Namor. I heard a rumor they're trying to bring in Storm too because y'all don't know, Black Panther used to get down with Storm. But I'm guessing if Storm gets into this MCU universe with Black Panther, Nakia's probably going to have her ass electrocuted by Storm. But I digress a little bit. So I want I want you guys to let me know. How do you feel about Black Panther being nominated for seven Oscars? Do I think it's going to win any of those? Maybe one. And I'm going to reserve the one I'm thinking about. But it definitely ain't going to be Best Picture. You can forget that shit. But I think it will win one. You let me know if you think it's going to win one. And what other comic book movies in the past do you feel should have been nominated for an Oscar? That's going to do it for this video. Don't forget to like my video. Please comment and subscribe. Go get yourself a life game. If you have something you want me to review, if you want to get a closer, if you want to get closer to me, join my email list, join the Life Games Facebook page, come over there, send me a message, we can wrap it up. And until the next Sex is Hell video, I'll see you.